about to show y'all the back of my hair. Can y'all see it? Is it giving natural or is it giving natural? Because what? Hello, palm shells. Welcome. <laughs> Ooh, every time y'all should know how the vlogs are about to start off. Hello, bombshells. Welcome or welcome back to another vloggy vlog vlog vlog. <laughs> I'm starting my vlog off how I usually used to. It's Sunday. We just got back from church. Y'all know the vibes. Ain't nothing changed. Um, let me show you our outfits. Ugh. This is little mama's outfit. Ooh. Let's cover you up. She got her little furberry, her Sheenberry dress on with her little fugs, not real Uggs, um, <laughs> and her little tights. Her Guys. little hair is cute. You got cute hair looks. Say hi. Yes. Hi. <laughs> A little outfit check for me. I don't know if y'all can see. It's my little um Fashion Nova pants. My Fashion Nova pants. It's like tannish. What's this color? Is it called taupe? Taupe? I think it's taupe. And then the top is like taupe, but it's like kind of off. I think the top came from Fashion Nova too, actually. I think it's all Fashion Nova. Who does that say, y'all? Does that say Fashion Nova? That say Fashion Nova. Okay, yep, Fashion Nova. And then I got this little um, furrer vest. Furrer. Um, I don't know where I got this vest from. Let's see. Oh, this is H&M. Child, I ain't been to H&M in years. I just found this in the closet. I said it'll be cute to throw on with the church fit. So, yeah, that's the outfit of the day. Um, Y'all know what I did after church. I went to Lidl, the grocery store. Do a quick grocery haul in a minute. Oh, Y'all, I have a migraine behind my left eye, and it is taking me out. Oh. I might need some sunglasses. It is taking me out. But I wanted to show y'all, speaking of glasses, that was not a plug on purpose. I was about to show y'all these anyway. I got my new glasses. Um, I've been ordering my glasses from um, Lensmart. This is my second pair. I don't know if y'all remember like the round pair that I was wearing. It's like um, it's like a wire brim on it. But anyway, those, those came from Lensmart and this is my second pair. I used to order my glasses from um, Uh, Zenny, Zenny Optical, Z E N N I Optical. Um, they got good glasses on there too, but I want to try something different because it's like more styles on these websites. So, these are my new glasses. It's like a little cat eye. Um, they're clear. They're clear, but it's like a little cat eye, and I really like them. They're clear, but it's like outlined with black. It's kind of like that um that cartoon look. Yeah. Child, this is a little wig here. I got a little U-part wig. It's a different one. It's a human hair one this time because um, my little, my girl, she was all right. If I claw clipped her and put her in a ponytail, my other one, that little synthetic one, she was all right. Um, I didn't even straighten this one out all the way. I just got her from the beauty supply store yesterday and clipped her on real quick. But she's giving very natural. It's like already layered. I like that. It's really cute though. It's a very natural look. And like like I said, I'm just tired of dealing with my hair. Um, it's like broken in the top. So I just, I want something normal. The back might still be like wavy because like I said, I barely flat ironed it. I just ran the flat iron through it really quick. But the good part about this wig, it's like a, um, a loose body wave. So I could like wet it and then like wave the top of my hair up so I don't have to keep um, flat ironing the top of my hair because child, my poor leave out. She ain't gonna curl back up. Like I've been flat ironing my leave out like every day for the past two weeks. Anyway, let's get into this grocery haul. Um, <laughs> I got some of these little um nor little noodle things. I get these because they're just like quick little sides. Quick little size for dinner. Um, oh, Lidl got these chocolate bars, the milk chocolate with almonds. If y'all been to Lidl before and y'all like, do you, 
Listen, y'all notice I haven't been to Trader Joe's in a while because I told y'all Lidl is low key giving Trader Joe's on a budget. Like, it's not even on a budget for real because, well, you know what it is because you get bigger portions. But like, the food at Lidl is top tier. They got organic stuff in there too. And then they got their own chocolate. They got their own brand of everything. Like, these are so good. Um, so I got two this time. And you know what? They used to be 99 cents and they are 124 now. Inflation. Um, got some barbecue sauce because I'll, I'm making something this week. So, I'm gonna tell y'all about HelloFresh in a minute. We ain't getting HelloFresh this week or next week. I don't know. I'm they on pause right now. Um, got some rice and because I don't care how old I get or how fake bougie you get. I like rice rice and roni. Um, and then I got these. This is Lidl. It's like the Lidl brand. Um macaroni and cheese out of the box but it's smoked gouda i'm gonna get that a try why not why not give it a try um what we else we get uh we got these french toast sticks kobe been on these real heavy um the double cinnamon ones the french toast sticks she eats these for breakfast like every day could you get out of there baby get out of there let's close it close it thank you close it thank you Big girl. Okay, you're opening it. Let's lock it. Let's lock it so you can't open it. Apple. Uh huh. Thank you. Yeah. So this has been like her breakfast, like every day. It's easy for my husband. He puts them in the air fryer, and um, when I'm home, I make her like other stuff. Um, get me some butter. I was out of butter, y'all. I've been using a lot of butter lately. Um, I don't know if that's a good thing. I've been cooking with butter, but um, I got the Lidl brand, like the sausage and egg croissants. I'm gonna try these out. So I, I've had breakfast in the morning for work because really I've been eating toasted shrews at work or like um, just munchkins from Dunkin' Donuts. And I really wanna like, Dada. yeah, and I really wanna like try to eat, um, eat breakfast in the morning and not, I should just eat fruit in the morning probably because I'm trying to lose weight. Um, I'm trying to lose this little stomach. My stomach has been a lot better. Um, I'm about to put my waist trainer on in a minute. I've been waist training and my waist trainer is, I'm trying to get it back to the, the smallest one. It's like three latches on it. I'm still on the first latch baby, but I think I could go down to the second latch today. Y'all pray for me that I don't pass out, but I'm gonna try it. Um, <laughs> But yeah, I gotta try to eat breakfast in the morning. I just be drinking coffee and eating munchkins or toasted strudels and I don't really like that vibe for me. On to the meat. I got two um Kobe. Kobe, don't eat that, please. I got Prince a toy. Oh, Prince's eighth birthday was on November 1st. And y'all, why did I forget my dog's birthday? It was like at night when I remembered his birthday from a Facebook memory. When I tell y'all my life is sweet. I never forgot his birthday before in my life and like I literally was like about to cry and I still feel horrible about it. But anyway, I got him a toy and he tore it up in like 20 minutes. So Kobe's playing with the stuffing in the toy now and yeah, that's that. But um, I got these chicken wings. Um, I don't know this brand. It's like a local farmer, farmer focus, organic, free range, whatever. I got two packs of those party wings because I make those sometimes with like um any side whatever it is I just make it um I got some chicken chicken breast fillets um I'll whip something up with that maybe some pasta or something with that one day this week um and then I got some boneless pork country style wig oh, wigs Ooh, wigs on my brain ribs my battery's about to die in my camera um got that that's why I got the um barbecue sauce and I also got some raw jumbo shrimp, frozen shrimp. Could probably make some pasta with that too this week. Let me change my battery before it dies. Be right back. Okay. Okay. Are we back? We're back. Okay. Excuse that mess on that side of the kitchen. Um, yeah, so I'm about to put all of these groceries away. Change us out of our church clothes. And try to get rid of this migraine because it is really killing me. I might need to put some on or something. It just came out of nowhere. I was outside talking to my mom in the driveway and 
Ooh, it came out of nowhere. Oh, and I got um Simply Lemonade, of course. I've been mixing the Simply Lemonade with um what is that tea called? It's in a refrigerator. The Milo's sweet tea. It's like this southern style sweet tea. If you're from the south, y'all know, like anything past South Carolina, we don't get sweet tea. Like sweet tea is not the same up here. And um we just went to um Georgia like I don't know, like a month ago probably we drove down to Georgia and that sweet tea was just hitting different. So I had to give me some Milo's tea. But anyway, I um mix my Milo's tea with just a little splash of my simply lemonade chef's kiss that is like my specialty for in the house um yeah i'm about to put these groceries away chill out a little bit welcome back to another weekly vlog y'all i'm back i'm back on it i'm back on the weekly vlogs i may have a little vlog in between here and there um it's so funny this wig i'm gonna oh well <laughs> Y'all know my attention span is so short, but this wig was like a last minute random thing at the beauty supply store because I really didn't feel like getting into the project that I was gonna get into, which might be another small vlog, but like I found all of this hair upstairs in the closet. Good quality bundles that I wore one time that I took out and I washed them and everything. And um, I was gonna go get baby girl from my mom's house yesterday. I was like, let me go to the beauty supply store. I'm gonna get me um, a little sewing needle and thread for the weave and I was about to attempt to do something and I might attempt it not this week probably not for a while because I'm gonna rock out with this one for a little while this she is soft this little unit here she is soft baby and I found her on Amazon for a cheaper price than the beauty supply store once again they got me again but it's okay because it was just like a random like okay I needed something for church in the morning again it always happens but they ain't gonna get me no more because now I know and um if y'all want a cheap little not cheap but it's human hair the hair is good she don't shed it's already layered like look at that it's really really cute I'm gonna link her down below because I found her on Amazon too and yeah I'm not gonna be selfish I'm not gonna send y'all to the beauty supply store and make y'all waste y'all money on these wigs when you could have just went on Amazon and got it for half the price we don't gotta talk about it though um HelloFresh back to HelloFresh Child, HelloFresh played with me. HelloFresh played with me. HelloFresh keeps playing with me. HelloFresh has played with me one too many times. Like, when HelloFresh is good, it's good. Like, the food is always good. The deliveries are good. But when you want to switch something at the last minute or anything, like, it, it's just bad. Like, the customer service is so hard. Like, how do you not know how to solve problems if this is your job? You are customer service. So yeah, I'm just like fed up and I ain't trying to be a Karen or nothing about the situation. Um, so rather than always complaining and calling them, um, I'm just putting them on pause right now. I might try Blue Apron again, but I was looking on Blue Apron and the recipes are not hitting like HelloFresh is hitting. Like if y'all know any more like food, like meal services or something that y'all have tried that y'all really, really like, please comment down below because I am searching for another food service because all this going to the grocery store and preparing meals and having to think of what's for dinner every night is not it. But we got to eat, so that's what we're doing. Um, yeah, thanks for coming to my TED Talk. I'm about to put my groceries away, chill out a little bit, and see y'all later. Oh, knock, mommy. No, don't knock my camera over. Uh, ah! Okay, say hi. Say hey y'all. Hey y'all, we back again. It's hot in here. <laughs> Say hey y'all, we back again. And we got a package. I was pressed. I wanted to open this up on camera. Um so I'm vlogging. I don't even know what time it is. Where's my phone? It's 926. We were sitting here watching some vlogs on YouTube and then my husband came back in and he said, you got a package. And I was like, oh yeah, I've been waiting on this. It's a Timu package. Stop, mama. Hopefully she don't knock the camera over. She's gone on, on her little merry little way now. Uh-uh, don't touch it. 
<laughs> anyway, I wanted to open this up now because I'm very, very anxious. Um, I'm gonna redo my lashes. I got some different lashes. They're supposed to be, stop. It's 80D D curl. And I think, I think the, the length is like, could you not do that, baby? Come on. I think it's like 10 to 16. I never go all the way up to the 16s. And I'm looking at it. Some of them is curled more than the other ones. Oh, that's so weird. This whole this whole row is like uneven. I don't know if y'all can really see it. Like this row right here is uneven. It's like shorter on this side and they get longer. But whatever. I'm um I want to use these. I hope they're like really really fluffy. I wanted to try to do the little TikTok lashes, but um I didn't um I didn't order those. I just ordered them off Timu. Um, I got these other like pre-made um, fans that I like mix in there. I just want a real like fluffy, fluffy DIY set. So I got those and I got this little mirror. This is just a mirror for doing lashes um, because somebody, somebody, yes, somebody, you want to show them? Here, look, show them. She's showing y'all the lashes. Yeah. Yeah. Because this is the somebody I'm talking about. She broke my other mirror for doing lashes. And, um. Oh, yeah. Somebody. Somebody is you. Then I got these, um, bottom lashes. Um, five, six, and seven. <laughs> They're very light. I don't even know if y'all can see them on camera. But I want to do my bottom lashes again. And these look like they'll show up better than the other ones. Like they, you won't be able to see them like as much as you saw. Okay. I'll show y'all tomorrow or the next day when I do my lashes. You show them. I got makeup brushes. She wants to show y'all that. Yeah. Let's see how they feel. How we open them, Mama? Oh, there we go. I needed some new makeup brushes. Y'all remember, I don't know if y'all remember a vlog. It was quite a few vlogs back. I was doing my makeup uh -huh. on camera. Oh, I think it was on the family channel. Oh no, it was this channel. The one I did the DIY with the sleek bun. Um, my makeup brush, my blush brush broke. It feels soft. That feel good? Yeah, but I got some makeup brushes. These were so cheap. I think they were... <laughs> I think it was like $2 and some change. And look, it's like little hairs coming off this one already. You get what you pay for, but I don't really do my makeup anyway. So it is what it is. Um, I just needed like some new brushes for like my blush and my um, highlighter. And I wanted to try to do um, my concealer with a brush. That's another story. Um, oh, this, 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 this. I was wondering, what is this? I got this little purse. Um, I need a new mom bag, but I need like a casual one. So I got this one. I think it was like $4. It was on sale. But it's like this little, um, it's like the, it's like a, a puffer coat. But you can fit a lot of stuff in it. And it's black. And then I can do it like a little crossbody too. Because I be needing a crossbody with her because she's just a whole lot to deal with. A whole lot, a whole lot of. So I got that. I think I'm gonna switch my stuff into it tonight. I just wanted something casual that's easy to, um, yeah, that you can put a lot of stuff in and that you can zip at the top. And she's still talking about these lashes, so, yeah. That's my quick Timu haul. I just wanted to come on here real quick and do that. We're going to get back to watching TV. I'm going to put my glasses back on so I actually can see, because like I told y'all in the other vlog, I think my last vlog, it should be. I'm posting it tomorrow, so yeah, it'll be out before this one. I can't see. I'm just looking in the general area of the camera. Everything is blurry. <laughs> um, but I didn't want to put my glasses on because it's gonna be a glare. But um, yeah, it's Thursday, y'all. Tomorrow's Friday, it's finally the weekend. Can't y'all see I'm beat down? <sighs> yeah. Kobe, you want to say bye bye? You want to say see you later? Want to say bye bye? Bye. Bye. Say see you later. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> we'll see y'all. I had something else to do. We'll see y'all tomorrow. Good night. Until next time, America.
Good morning, y'all. It's the next day. Had to come back and try it again, clearly, because my little side. She followed me downstairs. She must have known I was about to vlog. But anyway, it's Friday morning. It's 11.47. And um, I'm about to clean up the house a little bit. And then I'm going to run to the grocery store because I really want to make, um, I don't know why. I just woke up and I have a taste for um, English muffins, eggs, an English muffin, a bacon and egg sandwich on an English muffin, basically. That's what I want. So, but I need to sweep them out the floors real quick. So that's what I'm about to do. And um, then we gonna head on out to the grocery store. Am I gonna do my time? Yeah. Leaving me, out on me. Alright y'all, so I, um, 
So I don't have to go to the grocery store. My husband volunteered to go and to get us coffee. Thank goodness. So I'm still stuck here cleaning. But I forgot to put my shirt on. Mom life. I'm trying to hurry up and get dressed real quick. Oh. Oh y'all, I started waist training again. As you can see. And um, I put this on. Today is Friday. So seven days ago, I put it back on. And I was on the first loop. And it was a struggle to get it on. By Saturday, I was back on the second loop. And we've been going strong. It don't even hurt anymore on the second loop. That sounds crazy to say. Like, oh, it don't even hurt anymore. But, <laughs> yeah. Y'all know the waist trainers be hurting. But yeah, I got my arm. Um, I'm back to waist training. I've been wearing it all week. I've been going consistent for seven days. So, yeah. I'm gonna keep putting these dishes away so I can get back until my husband gets back. It is 12.54. I hope he hurries up and gets back because I got a client at 12, I mean at two, and another one at three. And I'm, I'm hungry. I'm hungry, I'm hungry, real hungry. And I think that his phone is dead and I really hope that he gets my coffee order right at Dunkin' because I usually do um, three pumps of, oh I got a new coffee, my hot coffee. It's not new, it's like the same as my cold, but um, I do, um, for my hot coffee, I think I do the same. Do I do sugar in a cold brew? I don't know. Anyway, my hot coffee is just a regular hot coffee, <coughs> cream, no sugar, and four pumps of butter pecan. The best. Um, I used to do three pumps, but I found that like the three pumps just wasn't hitting like it needed to hit. So I just said four pumps, and this has been perfect ever since. I must say the other day, I am so disappointed. The other day, um, what, what day was it? Wednesday, I went to Duncan. On Wednesday. On Wednesday, I went to Duncan and um, they, why would they put, they put cinnamon. They put cinnamon swirl in my coffee instead of butter. You can see. And it, it wasn't even a case of like, oh, maybe I said that. Maybe they misunderstood me. No, I did a mobile order, so you read it. But you still chose to put cinnamon in my coffee. And it ruined my whole day. I'm dramatic. It did not ruin my whole day. But it was rather disappointing. Rather disappointing to have to deal with that. You know that? Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. Um, but yeah y'all ain't much going on over here um i'm about to finish putting these dishes away make some breakfast do my clients um i got an amazon package i got an amazon package it should be rolling in here sometime today hopefully Let me see. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Yes, it shall be arriving today. And I can't wait to tell you guys all about it. And I can't wait to yeah. try it for myself. And then I'm gonna be, I'll order another one. I'm, I'm gonna do it. I'll tell y'all about it. Um. We gonna get to that later on. I'll talk to y'all. I'll see y'all when my package gets here. And um, cause nothing much is going on now. I'm about to finish this, make breakfast, do my clients, and I'll see y'all later. All right, y'all. So it is much later in the day. I'm done with my clients. It's 4:30. Kobe is sleeping. I don't know for how much longer because she's been asleep for like I don't know how long but as promised my Amazon package is here and I wanted to open it with you guys on camera so it is a fragrance review um, 
I like fragrances and I like to try new stuff and I finally got on this wave that I know I'm late to the party and everything, but I'm finally here. Um, I'm trying out the Middle Eastern perfumes. So, um, <laughs> okay. So this is the one I got. Um, the girls that already have it probably already know The girls that already have it probably already know um, what it is. Focus. Oh, now it won't focus on me. Come on, camera. Okay, I'm back in focus. Um, the girls that already have it probably already know what it is. It is called Bent Huron. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. Um, this one was, I think, $24. Let me get the exact price for y'all. So it's an Amazon fragrance. The Amazon Middle Eastern Arabian or Arabic. I don't know. Um, that's probably the same thing. Forgive me. Um, but let me tell y'all how much it cost. Exactly how much it cost. It was... $24.82 um, and it shipped in one day and yeah I'm gonna show y'all what the bottle looks like and we're gonna get into this smell I can't smell it yet <gasps> it's broken where is it Oh, okay, it's not broken. But this is what the bottle looks like. Y'all, that is so pretty. Looks real classy, so cute. Um, bent to run, like I said. Um, I'm not gonna smell it yet. I'm gonna read the notes to y'all. Okay, so the top notes are coriander, cypress, lemon, tangerine, sage, bergamot, and the middle notes are nutmeg, geranium, saffron, blue lotus, Lily of the Valley, cinnamon, and the base notes are musk, tobacco, vetiver, vetiver, I don't know, um, amber, sandalwood, and cedar. Um, sounds like a lot going on, but the girls on TikTok said it is a very seductive, nighttime, girly scent, so I said I'm gonna try it out. Mm. Just the first sniff smells real good. Let's try it out. I'm spraying the air too. <coughs> it's strong. It smells good though. Uh, it smells like something. It smells like something I've smelled before. You gotta let it warm up a little bit. Okay, y'all, I'm back. I let it simmer in for like five minutes. And it smells good, but I can smell like the florally. Hmm. It smells like something else that I've smelled before. I think this is a dupe for something. And I feel like it's like, it's, it, it smells like something that I have. And I don't know if this is why I sell one that I have. I'm gonna go get them, hold on. It's like, it's either this Gucci scent that I have or this white, hold on. Okay, I'm back. I turned the light on, it's getting a little dark too. But, um, let me. My scents are a little dusty. I don't really use them that much, which is crazy because I keep buying all these other fragrances and I low-key don't even use the ones that I have, but.
This definitely smells like something that, okay, so I got my Gucci Guilty. I'm not gonna spray it. Let me see. It's not the Gucci Guilty. Let me see. It's not Gucci Guilty. So is it this Gucci, everybody knows Old Faithful, Gucci Guilty. That's like one of my favorite smells, but um, it's, I, I don't hear the girls really talking about it the way they used to. And I haven't worn it in a while. I might try to wear it tomorrow. Cause I haven't, it used to smell really, really, really good on me. And I haven't used it in a while. I still got a half a bottle. I think I had this forever. And I don't know when it expires. <laughs> it doesn't really expire. I'm using it till it's gone. But um, then I got this Gucci bamboo one. My husband bought me this. I wasn't really a big fan of it. I have had this for years. Mm, it smells good. Maybe I may have to give this another try. I had to give that one another try. But this definitely, like the more is warming up, it smells like something that I already have. It smells good, but I'm not too crazy about it. No, they don't smell the same. So it's not that. But it smells so familiar though. And then I got this YSL. I forgot the name of it. My husband buys me all this stuff. And it's like a, let me see. How can I spray this? <laughs> Ooh, that smells, it smells. No, it don't smell like that. That smells sweet. Okay, so it's not the same. I don't know what this smells like, y'all. Now that we have taken 20 minutes to try to figure out what it smells like, and we still don't know what it smells like, um, it's a good addition. It's a good addition to It's pretty. It's pretty, but I'm not crazy about it. Give it my honest review. The girls on TikTok, TikTok, the girls on TikTok misled me this time. And usually TikTok don't fail me. I mean, it doesn't stink, and it's only $24. I'm gonna let it warm up more. But I'm about to sit here and watch TV until my baby wakes up, which will probably be soon. Um, but I did find a great dupe um, for the Baccarat. I found a great dupe for that on Amazon. I'm gonna link that down below too. Um, I ordered it today, it's not here now. Um, my coworker told me about it yesterday at work. Well, she told me about it earlier this week and then she said she's gonna bring it in so I could smell it. And she brought it in so I could smell it. And it is a dupe. And she sprayed it on her before she got to work and it was on her like the whole front desk smelled like it. And um, it was on her like all day. So it does last all day. And it's, um, it's one of the Middle Eastern scents as well. And then I got another one. I got a small bottle of this other one to test it out because my client just told me about it. So yeah, um, when those come in, we will do some reviews on those too. But yeah, um, the more and more I smell it, I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy about it. I'ma let it, I'ma let it simmer in, and then um, when I come back on here tomorrow or later on tonight, I'll let y'all know my final thoughts on this one after it completely warms up to my body. I think I'm gonna like spray it all over me just to see. Yeah, I'm gonna spray it everywhere. <laughs> we gonna get the full effect. We gonna get the full effect. And it's a big bottle too for $24. This is a huge bottle. I'm gonna spray it everywhere. Like I would normally spray my stuff on me. We gonna do the full experience so I can give y'all, this thing keep breaking off the top. At least it goes back in there. But um, yeah, I'll be back later or tomorrow. Later on this vlog, I'll be back with my final review on this. I don't know y'all. I'm very underwhelmed. I'm kind of low key disappointed. I'm a little sad because I was really excited to get this. 
let me stop chit chatting talking too much and sit here and enjoy some quiet time before this kid wakes up <laughs> i'll see y'all later hey bombshells it is like um i don't know how many days later since i seen y'all i don't even know the last day i picked up the camera um i was trying to stall i was trying to stall and like wait for my um turn drake off we got the kid in the back okay i was trying to stall so i could wait for the other um arabian um perfumes from amazon she don't start this until she knows i'm talking to the camera it's ridiculous but i'm at dunkin donuts right now about to get my order hold on y'all Baby, how you doing? Good, how you doing? Yeah. Okay. Well, Leticia. And you guys are out of the queso for the um the loaded thing. You're not can I get an order of those too? I'm sorry. Thank you. <laughs> the app said that you were out of the queso. Baby, I'm so glad you asked. Me too, because I love those. I haven't had a chance to try it yet, but I feel like the queso is really good. It, so yeah. Is it crack? Okay. It's, it's crack. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so she's like really nice. You don't get nice people like Dunkin' Donuts like this all the time. She's lit for early in the morning. I see why my mom like this Dunkin' Donuts. But y'all, while I'm sitting here, I got eight miles still empty and I passed like so many gas stations and I just don't feel like stopping. So but my mom's house is right here and it's a gas station right next to our house so we'll do that later coffee first but um i was trying to wait like i was saying i was trying to wait for those um amazon fragrances to come in and i don't think they're coming in and i think it's about time to close this vloggy vlog vlog out bless you baby i think it's about time to close her out so yeah i mean like not like this moment and Oh no, yeah, they're not coming until Wednesday and Thursday. Oh girl. Yeah, they'll be in the next vlog, y'all. But um, I just wanted to come on here and chit chat with y'all a little bit. About to go to my mom's house. Look at my hair. Could we get into the hair? I didn't like do my ponytail over again, but y'all, I did this myself. Like, I should have said, I did it out of order. I should have said, guess how much this costs? Guess how much it costs for me to do my hair? Well, not for me to do my hair. Guess how much it costs for my hair to get done. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not editing this in order. Y'all gonna get it raw. But um, guess how much it cost? Zero dollars. Found some old bundles in the closet that I used one time, and I did like the the four braid method. If y'all look up some videos, um, I'll probably try to link. I I don't think I could link so. I'll I'll put it in the, the the description box. The videos are like years old, but it's pretty much what we used to call a partial weave back in the day you know when they used to do the braids in between and just add like tracks in between the hair and it looks so natural why we ever stop doing this style y'all because this is it and i just did flexi rods in the back i kind of messed up on the top that's why it's like in a ponytail and i don't feel like taking these i should have did the braids and connected them but i did like two because i was going to wear my hair in the middle part but it looked like trash so then we took it out um so here we are and yeah so um where was I going with that? I don't know, but it's real cute. And I think I'm gonna keep doing my hair like this over and over again because I'm literally like, I'm low key like bald headed right now. My hair is like not doing what it's supposed to do. And that's so heartbreaking for me. Um, it just keeps falling out. Like I got breakage like all in the front of my head. The back is doing fine, but the front where it really matters is like all just falling out. And then I burned my leave out to death with my own um, new part that I was wearing for the last I think I wore a U-part wig. I wore that, that synthetic one for two weeks and then I used the same braids and I wore a human hair one that I got from the beauty spot store. Thank you. Oh, you oh, I got like way more foods. I got like um a Boston cream donut. I got, I don't know. I got Boston cream got donut. Order? Yeah, the mobile order. Yeah, so if you could, um, have, whatever you do, it's not printed out my hands. Oh. Sorry. No, you're okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. 
uh, I got so you got my coffee. I got um, everything mini big, the little mini bagels, mm -hmm. uh, three munchkins, just the assorted ones, and okay. then I got her um, a English muffin with just toasted with butter. Okay. And um, classic donut, the uh, Boston cream. You want this? Yeah. <laughs> if yeah. it stays. <laughs> okay, y'all. So got my Dunkin' order secured. I got a whole bunch of stuff. I just love Dunkin' Donuts. Is like one thing I like about Dunkin' Donuts is like every time you go there, your coffee is consistent. It's always gonna taste the same. Starbucks. Starbucks really be trying it sometimes like it's like it's simple we I literally I do mobile orders all the time so it's not like I'm telling you the drink wrong or anything like that so it's like why can't you just get my drink right every time why does it taste different sometimes why is it bitter why is it not giving every time and coffee be costing too much money for it to not taste good and then you'd be mad when you pull off from the drive-thru but yeah. I don't have no car tripod yet, y'all. Just mind your business. Um, <laughs> I haven't vlogged in the car in a long time, especially not while I was driving. But anyway, um, yeah, but I get um, my my coffee right now since it got cold. I just get a regular... Okay, baby, we almost got grandma's house. I just get like a regular hot coffee. Um, four pumps of butter pecan swirl and three creams. And that's it very simple but it tastes so good it's such a such a delightful drink for in the morning um especially since it's cold outside now i haven't really been doing cold brews or iced coffees or like anything iced lately um but yeah oh back to this hair yeah i don't know what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna keep doing this like if my hair it will come back my hair always comes back but like this just is weird i'm about to miss the light um it's just oh my three miles to empty i should probably stop at the gas station <laughs> I'm gonna stop at the gas station before I get to my mom's house. Um, hopefully I don't run out of gas. The gas station's right there, but I'm at three miles still empty now. I don't know what happened. But yeah, y'all. Um, yeah, but this will do. I feel like a baddie again. Because my hair ain't all... It just look. Oh, that's what I was saying. I fried my leave out to death, y'all. Like, oh my God. It's like... It was already struggle nation up there at the top of my head anyway. But then I fried, fried, fried. Why am I zipped up to my neck? Because I'm classy. That's why I'm zipped up to my neck, baby. <laughs> you know, it's cold outside. Um, but yeah. I'm, gonna give me, I'm about to give me some gas. Go to my mom's house. I'll probably vlog a little bit in there. And my mom's house. We're going to sit over there for a little while. Probably go home like 1 o'clock. Oh, it's 11 a.m. Today is Monday. November 13th my off day this week so here we are thanks for listening to me talk um but yeah those the fragrances will be in the next vlog that's the moral of the story see you in a little bit bye okay y'all we are back home from my mom's house i did not vlog over there we just chill for like Let's see, what time is it now? It is 1.49, we just got home like 30 minutes ago. We just chilled over there for a little while. Oh, let me let show y'all the back of my hair. Can y'all see it? Is it giving natural or is it giving natural? Because what? I even did my parts like crooked, not on purpose, it's because of the way I did the braid at the top, but it looks so natural, it looks like I just like randomly grabbed a piece of my hair and put up in a ponytail. But it's giving very, very natural, okay? And I love that. At first I just had the blonde pieces in there. And then I added like the dark pieces. So it blends so well. And I love this for me. So y'all will be seeing this hair for a while. Um, I won't be doing this ponytail for a long time. I'm going to redo this top part. And make that part look better. Because I want to just do like a little. The natural little flip over thing. That's another thing. But um, I wanted to show y'all. This book that I got from Amazon. And I hope that I really like it. It is the social media content planner and um i need to get more organized like and like i, I have video ideas all the time up here like what i want to do in my vlogs and vlogmas is coming up and i really want to grow my channel um and i hope that i can get monetized by the end of vlogmas i will get monetized by the end of vlogmas 
I'm putting it out there. I'm gonna get monetized um, by the end of Vlogmas. So yeah, I thought this was the perfect time to get this book. It's a little planner and um, yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. It was so cheap. I'll link it down below. I got it on Amazon. I think it was like $8. I've been seeing all the other ones that cost like $20 and all this other stuff, blah, blah, blah. Unless y'all giving me the cheat code, I'm not getting the book. Cause literally all it is is a planner. And um, I like how this one looks. It's like, um, Social media planner. Planner. It goes week by week, and as uh, Monday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and then I guess you could just write your different video ideas on each row, and then um, the next page, like it has the title of what you want to do. Um, like a description. I don't think all that is necessary. And then it has like a to-do list, like everything that you want. So at least this way, I mean, it just seems like it'll be, oh, and which social media platform you want to do. So like, this must be old because I don't see TikTok on there. When was this book made? Let's see if it's a... November 12, 2023. So why don't I have TikTok on there? That's a little weird. Everybody's TikToking now. Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. I don't know what IN is. YouTube, and then it's like an envelope. I don't know what that is. But anyway. Um, oh, and then it's so cool. Like when you do the video, it tells you like, you know, sometimes I don't know if y'all notice. I say I'm going to link it down below and then I forget. And then like I'll be watching the blog back through like days later. Like after I already posted it, I'm like, dang. I forgot to post that link. I forgot to put the link down there. So it's even a section here, like link to include, like it just reminds you like what to do. So like after I finish something, I could just go back to like my category. Yeah, but anyway, y'all, I'll let y'all see for yourself. It's so cheap, it's worth it. Like, come on now. It's it's a win-win here. And I, I feel like it's just gonna keep me very um, organized. And I love that for me because girl, She's not organized at all. I need one of these for my life because chow. Yeah, but I think I'm gonna start writing down some Vlogmas ideas in here. That's what I'm getting ready for, Vlogmas. We're gonna finish out the rest of this month. November, it's crazy. We already halfway through November, but we're gonna finish out the rest of this month and I'm about to sit here and start figuring out my Vlogmas ideas. I'm writing it all down. Y'all get ready for Vlogmas. Like, I hope I hold myself accountable. I hope I hold myself to it because I really, really, really want to grow my channel, Vlogmas. I want to grow my channel now, but I think Vlogmas is going to be it because I heard, I heard, I heard, I heard. Y'all know what I heard. Um, <laughs> but yeah, that's it for this vloggy vlog vlog. Um, this one was very uneventful. We went on a date on... Saturday night, we went on a cute little date. I might insert like the TikTok that I did for that. I only did a TikTok, I didn't feel like vlogging that night. We went on a cute little date. Um, that's why I did my hair, because I wanted to be cute. Like we went on a random date and I just like randomly did my hair. Like my husband asked me that morning, like it was cute. He said, can I take you out to dinner later? And I was like, who me? <laughs> so I had to get cute. And, um, yes, yeah, so I did my hair, like, so fast, like, um, and I had clients that day and everything, so I did my hair. He asked me that morning, I had, I think I had two clients that day, and I finished my clients, and I hurried up and did my hair. I think I was done with my clients, like, 3.30, and then I did my hair, and I was ready for dinner, and we were on time by 8.30. We were at the restaurant at 8.30. Could y'all believe that? Me? But yeah, that's because my, my daughter was at my mom's house. He took my daughter to my mom's house. She stayed the night over there, and we had a nice little adult outing and it was lovely i love dating my husband <laughs> but anyway y'all thanks again for watching this vlog please like comment share um subscribe of course um that's it the restaurant we went to was lock bar i was closing this out it's lock bar it's in baltimore um so it was nice like the food was good and like everyone always goes here and like i've heard so much so much hype about it when we got in there 
I don't know if it's probably better in the summer. And I guess it was the atmosphere. Like, I'm gonna link it. I don't even think y'all can see the water because it was nighttime. But it's like on the water. It's real cute. And it's an outside seating area. But of course, it's cold. So we couldn't sit outside. But literally, it's like this whole level of my house was the size of, of the restaurant. Like, that was it. And we was like sitting, we were sitting at this little small table. Like, it's like a long booth. So I guess it's like more for big parties probably. I could see... But when you break the parties up into smaller parties, we were literally sitting like, uh, we're sitting here, it's a small table, like this wide, we're sitting here, and then like this much space in between us and the next couple. I ain't like that. I ain't like that at all. But the food was good. The drink that I got was so good. I think it was um hmm, something about Baltimore Lemon. Baltimore lemonade, Baltimore lemonade, something. Apparently it's this thing that they do in Baltimore. They, um, I don't have my blinds open and the sunlight kind of just went down. My neighbors are working on their deck so I just kept the curtains closed today. But anyway, um, I could have opened this one but I didn't feel like it cause it'd be like washing everything out. Girl, come back, get back on, get back on topic. So apparently in Baltimore it's this thing that you do with peppermint and lemon. I never knew that but anyway, that drink was fire. It has like, the, the alcohol in it is vodka and it's so good it tastes like lemonade and it's so good and sweet and i love lemonade right i only got one thank goodness because i wanted to get another one child by the time i got to the end of that first one i started to get real tired so i had to give me a baileys and coffee because yeah your girl would have been sleep on the car ride home but anyway that's neither here nor there um like comment subscribe share this video tell a friend tell a friend Thanks again for coming back to this vlog, guys. If you've been here before, if you're new, thank you so much for watching this entire vlog. I hope you're still here with me. Um, I'll see y'all in the next vlog.